Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be showing you how to get this look right here, which I did over on my Instagram. I've slightly changed it since the one uh, than the one that I did on my Instagram. But if you want to see how to get this look, then just keep watching. For my brows, I'm going to be using the Revolution Flawless Resurrection 3 palette, and I just use a combination of these two shades here. Just an angled brush, just to fill in my brows. I go in with the lighter shade first, and I go quite far forward with my brows. I did on this look. My eyes were so dark that I felt my brows had to give, had to bring a little extra something. Now that my brows look ridiculous, I'm going to go around them with my supersized concealer and define concealer. This look, I used the NYX Warm and Neutrals palette. Um, I just think this is really beautiful to do sort of like a red smoky eye, which is exactly what I did with this look. I think it is just stunning. Honestly, this look is amazing. If I do so for myself. <laughs> so I'm going to start off with my big fluffy blending brush and I'm going to use this colour right here. That's my first transition, which I know is quite dark and normally, as you guys will know, I go for something a little bit lighter. But because all of these colours are so dark, I feel like the darker transition shade just works ever so slightly better and then I'm going to use this red here and just run that through the crease on the same fluffy blending brush go like here just on a small little my little round brush you know you guys know the brush i'm just gonna pack that on the outer corner with my eye and then blend it in with my eyes with my Concealer. I'm just going to use a flat foundation brush just to to clean it up because I would have went straight in my bag and then onto foundation I'm going to be using the Conceal and Define foundation from Revolution just swipe it on my face And I'm just going to use my Real Techniques sponge to blend that out. I've missed out on a beauty blender. Give me my concealer. powder just to set underneath my eyes I sort of push the powder underneath my eyes on a night uh, before a night out rather than um, like 
swipe it on just so it sort of bakes it, but I don't like to feel it actually baking my face. Back onto the eyes, I'm just going to take a combination of this one and this one and run them underneath my eyes. Now I'm going to take this one here on my finger and then just place it on my lid. Obviously, guess what I used? I used my Bad Girl Bang by Benefit. Just to coat my lashes. my Revlon Sculpt and Highlight Contour Kit and I use my little my contour brush from Nail Techniques just to dip into that contour shade and just define my cheekbones. That which is this one here just on my angle brush and uh, bronzed up my face. Revolution Pro Highlight, Supreme Highlight in Ice, and I'm going to take the blue for a change because I've never worn blue highlighter before. So we'll see how we'll see how this goes. I'm just taking my brow contour pull and taking the highlight shade. Put right there. I don't do the whole brow. Right at the front so you can see that sort of definition, the, the, the change. Uh, liquid lipstick in Manila. And there we go, guys. That is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, comment down below what you would like me to do next. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.